Well, hello everyone. This is DJ Mash and Master once again, and here I am once again to share another simple tip or a trick you can say that you can utilize in your DJ sets to close your DJ set in a style. It is a very simple technique. Let's see what the settings that you need to use. First and foremost, I've got the CDJ 3000 here set up on a vinyl mode. I'm going to be using very, very simple uh, technique for a beginner DJs so that you can utilize it. And then eventually I'll go into the advanced way of using this uh, particular technique. The technique is divided into various steps. The first step is to create a loop, which is a one beat loop. So I'm going to shift my B2 from eight lead to simple one beat loop. Now, I'm going to shorten this loop. There are different ways to shorten this loop. If you see this arrow keys here, you can use them to shorten the length of the beat by pressing the left arrow. Now, when you've reached at this stage, all you are going to do is press the pause button stops in a way that you're putting a vinyl stop on your track but to do so make sure that your vinyl speed adjustment is set to the long release so that when you are in the loop mode it stops slowly and it even starts slowly when I press play now let's see how I can combine this particular technique with some color effects on the mixer I'm going to be using the filter here to create further more excitement and tension among the minds of the people so let's just recap the technique, create a one beat loop, set it on a vinyl mode, set the vinyl adjust speed to the long release, turn the filter on, set the parameter to your liking, how harsh you want the resonance to be. So I have the track going on here. I go to my beat loop, set the one beat loop. Now I'm gonna use a filter. See you in the next tips and tricks from MASH.